there's problems with the devices themselves. There's all sorts of issues with the way they're administered by the police. And finally, there's issues with the motorist or, uh, or the individual who takes the breath test. Conditions like GERD, heartburn, acid reflux, diabetes, dentures, braces, dental pockets, cavities, all of these things are prone to create what we call mouth alcohol contamination and generate falsely high readings on the machines. Someone who's really a 0.05 can easily blow a 0.15 when this happens.